we recording now? Call it action. Yes, yes, the people, welcome back to another episode of the UK Stole It! This one is about music, and this is a script by the one and only Faye over there in the corner. Woo! Just like in a concert, get it? Because it's a music related episode. <laughs> Roll the intro. <laughs> the UK birthed many popular music genres such as beat music, psychedelic music, progressive, heavy metal, new wave, industrial music, you get the point, we invented a lot of music. We also originated lots of famous bands such as the Beatles, Oasis, Queen and many many other solo British artists as well such as Olly Murs, Browie, George Michael, however, quite a few solo artists originated in bands and as the girls insist I read the script, OMG! We've got Liam, we've got Noel, you know, we're on a first name basis, we're buds, all the boys from One Direction. Of course, there are many songs that artists stole or had at least influence from. Rod Stewart, do you think I'm sexy? Seriously, do you? Leave it in the comments. Influences from the music of the United States, including blues, jazz, rock and roll, were adopted in the United Kingdom. We stole a lot from America, who in turn stole a lot from black culture. So, who's the real villain here? I'm curious what you think. Leave it in the comments. And now, ladies and gentlemen, yes, that's right, Elvis Presley. You ain't nothing but we had a lot of influences from Elvis Presley, who was that amazing he didn't even need to leave his home country of America to reach global success. However, it is a well-known fact that Elvis stole a lot of his music from black culture, such as the hit Hound Dog, which oddly enough has been remixed time and time again on TikTok. Where you can also follow us. Link in the description! <laughs> Rob Stewart didn't deliberately steal Do You Think I'm Sexy, but he openly admits to subconsciously plagiarizing Brazilian artist George Ben Hor. It's spelled with a J, I swear. While in Brazil, Stewart heard yours track Taj Mahal, which sunk into his brain and formed the basis for Do You Think I'm Sexy? Still asking. To Stewart's credit, he held his hands up and he said, look, I stole it. Or kind of got inspired from it. He settled the issue outside of court and all of his proceedings have been given to charity. I need somebody. What about the Beatles, right? A staple of UK music culture. The famous band they stole from Chuck Berry, who was an American solo artist. Can you believe it? The song opens with the phrase, here comes the flat top. And the seagull. A line lifted directly from Berry's 1956 hit, You Can't Catch Me. Yeah, come on, flat top. He was moving up with me, then come. George Harrison and his solo career stole from American Delaney Bramlett in his song My Sweet Lord. Delaney claims George Harrison was backstage at one of his duos and Delaney and Bonnie show in 1969, if the script is correct. According to him, he, as he states, I grabbed my guitar and started playing the Chiffins melody from He's So Fine and then sang My Sweet Lord, Oh My Lord, Oh My Lord. Two years later, he heard Harrison's My Sweet Lord on the radio. So obviously, Bamlet immediately called Harrison up to say he hadn't meant for him to use his exact melody. Yo, hey, hey, hey. hey. He hadn't meant for him to use his exact melody and complained about receiving no credit whatsoever. He quote, I quote him saying, I never saw any money from it and neither did George. And that's where the script ends. So I guess this is how the video ends as well. So cheers later. Bye. No, I'm only joking. Hey, listen, this has been a quick video and it's mainly for the music fans out there, but if we've missed any of your favorite songs, please leave them in the comments and we'll do them in part two, three, and all the way to 176. My name is Bogdan, subscribe to the channel, press the little bell thing after that to get notifications when we upload something new and remember to follow us on all them social media platforms with the links in the description. I'll leave it here and I'll see you next week on a new video. Laters!